Welcome back everyone to another tutorial on Tableau. This series of videos will help you take your skills from beginner to expert level in Tableau. Do not forget to hit the red subscribe button and the bell icon so that you are the first one to know whenever I upload any new video. In today's session we will see how to use parameter to change the dimensions or measures that we have in the view. Let me first show you the demo of what we will be doing today. Here I have a bar chart that shows sales of different categories that we have in the data set. The requirement is that we have to give user functionality to change the dimension that is category or the measure that is sales in this bar chart. Suppose any user might be interested to see sales done in different regions or might be interested to see what was the quantity of different categories sold. Then using these parameters, he or she can change the dimensions or measures that we have in the view. Suppose we want to see profit earned in different regions. So first from the dimension parameter, we can select region. So you will observe that the view has updated to show different regions. And in the title also we can see that this view shows us region wise sales, but the user wants to see region wise profit. So under measure selection parameter select profit. Now we can see what was the profit earned in different regions. These parameters will give user functionality to view this bar chart according to the dimensions and measures they are interested in. Now let's jump to Tableau and see how to create a view similar to this one. We will create two different parameters. First one that will allow user to select dimension and the other one that will allow user to select measures. So click on the drop down. Click on create parameter. Let's name it dimension selection under data type select string. Click on list. So first dimension will be category. Second we can give region next will be segment and the last will be sub category you can give any dimensions here according to your requirement click on ok now create the second parameter click on the drop down click on create parameter let's name it measure selection under data type select string click on list so first value will be sales second will be profit then third will be quantity and last will be profit percentage click on ok the two parameters are ready now we will use the parameters that we have created to create calculated fields. So click on this dimension selection drop down and select create calculated field. Let's name it dimension and the formula will be if dimension selection parameter equal to category then we want to see category dimension else if dimension selection equal to segment then we want tableau to return segments else if dimension selection equal to sub category then we want tableau to return subcategory 
else if dimension selection equal to region then we want tableau to give us region and make sure to give the correct spellings as you have given in the parameter so if the user will select category from the dimension selection parameter then we will get categories in the view if the user selects a segment from the dimension selection parameter then we will get segment and so on click on okay now we will create a similar calculated field for measure so click on this measure selection drop down and select create calculated field let's name it measure and here the formula will be if measure selection parameter equal to sales then we want tableau to return sum of sales else if measure selection parameter equal to profit then we want tableau to return sum of profit else if measure selection parameter equal to quantity then we want tableau to return sum of quantity else if measure selection parameter equal to profit percent then we want to see profit percentage which is sum of profit divided by sum of sales and so if the user will select sales from the measure selection parameter then we will get sum of sales then if the user selects a profit percentage from the measure selection parameter then we will get profit percentage which is equal to sum of profit divided by sum of sales and here also make sure to give the correct spelling as you have given in the parameter click on okay now drag the dimension calculated field that we have created to column shelf then drag the measure calculated field that we have created to row shelf let's change the fit to entire view now show both the parameters click on the drop down click on show parameter then click on the drop down click on show parameter now here we see the sales of different categories suppose we want to see region wise profit so from the dimension selection parameter select region and from the measure selection parameter select profit so here the tableau gives us region wise profit so using these two parameters we can select any dimension or measure as per our requirement let's turn on the labels by clicking on show marks label button let's change the display format to show profit in terms of uh, dollars click on format then go to pane under numbers drop down select currency custom we don't want to show any decimal places let's select this dollar sign and we want display units as thousands click anywhere outside last thing to add here you will notice that if i select profit from the measure selection parameter the profit is shown in terms of dollars and if i select profit percent here you will observe that we are seeing zero dollars as the labels which is not correct so by default a particular display format that we have selected will work for all the measures that we have under the measure selection parameter so let me select sales the display format of sales is coming correct only for profit percent 
the display format is not correct a workaround here is that we will create two separate calculated fields one for the profit percent and another one where we will include the remaining measures sales profit and quantity so we will create calculated fields using the measure calculated field just duplicate this field click on duplicate now let's edit this field name it profit percent label and here remove everything except the profit percent if major selection equal to profit percent then sum of profit divided by sum of sales we are creating these fields only because we have to show different number format for profit percentage so click on ok create one more duplicate field so click on the drop down click on duplicate now let's edit this field click on the drop down click on edit let's name it remaining label and from here remove this profit percent and keep the remaining measures sales profit and quantity click on ok now drag both the label fields that we have created to label let's change the format of this profit percent to show profit percent in terms of percentage go to percentage we don't want to show any decimal places then let's change the number format of remaining label currency custom we don't want to show any decimal places display units as thousands and the prefix will be dollar sign click anywhere outside now you will observe that the profit percentage is coming in terms of percentage then let me select sales sales is also coming in terms of dollars then if I select quantity okay we will have to create separate calculated field for quantity as well because we can't show quantity in terms of dollar no problem we will create one more calculated field now let's edit this remaining label field and from here remove quantity also click on ok now let's duplicate this measure field now edit this field we will create separate calculated field for just quantity because we can't show quantity in terms of dollars so from here remove everything except for quantity let's name it quantity label click on ok now drag this quantity label also to label now we are getting the label in correct form so now we are able to correct the display format of all the measures i have already created a detailed video on this to display different measures with different number formats in tableau you will find the link of that video in the top right corner and i have also added the link of that video in the description below next hide this field label right click click on hide field label for columns then let's remove the header right click uncheck show header lastly let's edit the title to clearly tell the user what dimension and measures we have in the view so insert both the parameters we can give the title dimension wise measure so basically the title will be region wise quantity if i select sales from the parameter then the title will update and tell the user that this chart shows us region wise sales 
let's change the dimension let me select category now the chart gives us category wise sales let's also edit the tooltip in the tooltip we can show which dimension and measure the user has selected so go to tooltip before this let's add the dimension parameter then for measure also let's do it add the measure parameter and this aggregate measure will come after this parameter and remove everything else and here let's write down dimension and here we will write measure click on ok so we can easily tell that the dimension selected is category and under category we are viewing this sales for furniture category then this is category office supplies let me change the region and let's select profit now the dimension selected is region and we are viewing the profit for the east region so accordingly you can update the tooltip as per your requirement so in this way we can give functionality to the user to select dimension or measure according to their requirement this was all that i had to cover in this session i have added the link of this workbook in the description below do not forget to hit the thumbs up button if you like this session thanks for watching this video see you in the next tutorial